York taking a look at Alexis Littlefoot making her TSW debut. Calls herself the big flexer out of Lexington, Kentucky, trained by Larry D of Impact Wrestling fame. She's not just tough, she's smart as well. Bachelor's degree of arts journalism, bachelor's degree of arts in journalism, I'll say that right the second time, and also in fashion merchandising. That's right, dual bachelors from the University of Kentucky. We know that Book Smarts has paid off already for GPA. We'll see if Alexis Littlefoot's in the same boat. Well, you ready to dish out a little bit of karma? That's what Kaya McKenna's looking for. The conduit of karma. She's a good witch, but she can have a bad side, which needs to be, right? And so far, it's paid off. Here at Tri-State Wrestling, she herself, Kyle McKenna, undefeated here in the blossoming women's division in TSW. Ladies and gentlemen, to my right, hailing from Lexington, Kentucky, the big flexor, Alexis Littlefoot! Well, certainly it's a uh, big flex from Alexis Littlefoot to come to the ring draped in that expensive looking coat. I'm not sure what exactly that was made out of or how much money it'll set you back, but I know Alexis Littlefoot not losing sleep over it and immediately to the outside wants nothing to do with Kai McKenna. We'll see what the strategy is of this Newcomer Alexis Littlefoot who can strike, technical wrestler, she can do it all. She looks pretty confident right now. No one has been able to knock out McKenna thus far. And McKenna looking to take this matchup back in the ring and if Alexis is successful in making McKenna a bit impatient, go a long way. McKenna, of course, trained with the Black and the Brave, Davenport, Iowa area, Merrick Brave and uh, Tyler Black, who if you are unfamiliar with the name Tyler Black, he is now known as Seth Rollins. So certainly you speak of having a good foundation. You speak of getting started on the right foot. And right now it's McKenna having the foot Oh, Alexis Littlefoot. And applying pressure to the ankle. Nice oh, gripping her own wrist to get some leverage on that hold, but Alexis pulling the hair and whatever she can. And she'll need that a whole lot more because McKenna take advantage. Looking for a submission in the early going with this uh, modified bow and arrow. Shoulders down, but little foot back to her feet. And McKenna, look, both athletes jockeying over backslide. Looking to do some damage here in McKenna. Buries the knee. And that may knock the wind out of little foot. Second time. Notice how McKenna does not release the grip. 
board. All right, shoulder tackle takes her down. McKenna looking good here at this point in time. And it comes through, charging with a splash, gets that momentum, that head of steam rolling to the canvas. Lateral press for two. Good job, Rob. And you got to give it to Alexis Littlefoot, who's been able to get back into this thing, or at least stay in this thing, and go to the eyes to stay in this thing. Double handful of hair. Alexis getting desperate. Could this do it? No. You can't only. Man, the damage done. And McKenna trying to cover up, and Alexis looking for daylight. Firing through. We talked about the striking game. Alexis multifaceted. She's walked the red carpet. Hulu's version of uh, White Men Can't Jump. Part of that premiere and festivities. And fires away a left-handed knife edge shot. Lesser seen, but got the damage done, certainly. And the woman that owns uh, over 200 pairs of sneakers. And one of those such pairs she's uh, adorning now. Alexis could take the winner's share of the purse money, add to that collection, drives in with the knee, shoulders down, two count only. And just like that, in the span of a couple of minutes, you can feel things change around. The Ocean City, Maryland native, who's defeated Kayla Cassidy, Ari Alexander, but has not been able to figure out Alexis Littlefoot. And Alexis puts her name on the map here tonight if she's the first one to knock off Kaya McKenna. McKenna looking to battle to her feet. She's gonna miss! And that high kick connected. Right to the back of the head. Will that be all? Two count only. You can sense those two counts are getting longer, and you can sense Alexis is getting more confident as time goes on. And you don't want to waste time, though. Or else there may be some karma dished your way one way or another. But again, notice Alexis gripping her own wrist and forearm to keep the pressure of that hold intact. She let go for a moment, but now has it cinched in. It's going to be harder for McKenna to break that hold with Alexis's hand in that position. And if this arm drops, no, it doesn't. Switches the weight, those shoulders down for two. Back to her feet. Oh, went to charge in. Went to do it in Kaya McKenna. Build that momentum now. And dish it out some karma. Is she a good witch or a bad witch? Right now, it may not matter. Here comes McKenna with a side suplex. Is that enough? No. Tell Kaya thought that was it, but if her trainers instilled anything in her, it's don't argue with the official, don't waste time. That decision was final, it's two. You gotta keep pressing that advantage and I hope you can find a way. Now wait a minute, Littlefoot rolls through, dropped down, made herself small to try to trap the shoulders of McKenna, who was looking to go up. Alexis, yeah, look at, look at to turn things around, check this out. Big flex, big flexibility into the near fall. Oh 
nearly puts things away. As these athletes continue to do battle, center of the ring, a lot of pride at stake and certainly a think about what the women's division could look like in the months ahead. Both, both these athletes would love to be that stalwart, that centerpiece, that, that it figure that everybody wants to test themselves against. McKenna looking to get some leverage. Littlefoot tried to counter by widening her face, but that's the black culture fall, and McKenna stays undefeated. Continues her winning ways in Tri-State Wrestling. You gotta wonder who's gonna be next to challenge the conduit of karma here in what's rapidly becoming her home, TSW. Still ahead, the man that says the world only makes sense when you force it to. Damian Chambers, Danny Bennett standing by with Cole.